Hey everybody, it's Mike Caruso, publisher of the Fisherman Magazine, and today we're going to talk a little bit about the 2023 Dreamboat Fishing Challenge. If you know about the Dreamboat Fishing Challenge, you know it's a subscriber-only, region-wide, multi-species, uh, season-long fishing competition where anglers throughout the Northeast and parts of the Mid-Atlantic are competing uh, for point gathering points to win the ultimate prize, the Steiger Craft with the Yamaha engine, the Minn Kota package, uh, and the Hummingbird package. An incredible first, first place prize for the angler who uh, has the highest number of points. You now we have a second place prize for a trip to Marina Pesvela in Costa Rica, ultimate fishing destination. And third place is a Sea Eagle inflatable kayak. And so, uh, many, many other prizes, of course, for the largest of species, uh, for the fish of the month, and we have 70 different standings. There's seven species, and for each of those species, there's 10 positions. First heaviest fish, the second heaviest fish, the third heaviest fish, all the way down to the 10th place fish. All those standings, and you know, the way it works is if you have that heaviest fish, you're going to get 10 points. Second heaviest fish gets 9 points. Third heaviest fish gets 8 points. In descending order, right down to that 10th place fish where you still get 1 point. The cumulative total of points is what you want to be thinking about. You have the guy who wins, the person who wins, will have the most points. So you want to be thinking uh, very strategically this year uh, for... Uh, accruing those points and targeting species at the times when they are most likely uh, to be uh, trophies. And so the process is where you uh, take the fish down to a weigh-in station, which are comprised of tackle shops. Of course, we list them uh, on the website and in the magazine, and um, you have to fill out the form. Uh, the uh, tackle shop will uh, take the measurements, the weight of the fish, endorse your form, which are also found on thefisherman.com. Uh, and it is your responsibility as the angler entering the fish to uh, mail back or email us back uh, a photo of the fish and your endorsed form. What's new this year, and there's two things. You know, we've been doing the Dreamboat for, uh, for over a decade now, and um, we wanted to pave the way for... For new anglers to actually rise to the top and win that first place uh, prize. And so this year, we, uh, we are limiting the entries uh, to those who, all of those who are subscribers, with the exception of those who have won the first place prize before. So, um, you know, so there's, uh, there's a legacy of, of winners. They won't be in the contest this year, so it opens and paves the way for someone new to win that boat, as I said. The other addition, and this is really, really cool. We came up with something called wild card prizes, where uh, this standings board comprised of 70 different positions. Uh, we are randomly today going to select uh, positions and apply prizes. We have a surplus of prizes that are going to be applied to the standings board. In here, I have 70 ping pong balls, and every single one of them are labeled and correspond with uh, one of the positions. Uh, on our standings board, which again, this does not start till May 1st. All we're doing today is applying prizes to the standings board. So I'm going to start. I'm going to spin our raffle bucket. And um, what we're going to do is uh, basically, we're going to pick out, well, first I'm going to show you the first prize. The first prize uh, is an Ingle cooler. And uh, excellent cooler, this thing will keep uh, whatever you're trying to keep cold for days. I'm going to pick a ball, and this particular ball corresponds with Sea Robin, the ninth place Sea Robin. Okay, so whoever at the end of the contest is in ninth place is going to win that cooler. Okay, the next prize, well, I should say prizes because there's four of these accurate reels, the Fury. And so, I'm going to go in there and mix them up a little bit. I'm going to pick a ball. Okay, the first accurate re reel will be the fourth place wheat fish. Okay. The second accurate reel will be sea bass. Fourth place sea bass. The third accurate reel 
Another weak fish, the eighth place weak fish is the third accurate reel. And the last accurate reel is going to be a sea robin, the fifth place sea robin. Okay, so I'm going to move on. There are more prizes. This one's incredible. This is the Psionic Night Wave, and it's a light gathering, low, very extremely low light unit to mount on your boat that allows you to see in color at night and uh, really, uh, really sophisticated piece of equipment for your boat. And so uh, this, uh, this prize, will add that to the standing board as a wild card prize. Mix them up real good. And the psionics will be positioned. Bluefish, eighth place. All right, so out of the 10 places for, for bluefish, the eighth place fish will be assigned to the psionics. The tsunami, we have a tsunami evict reel, okay? And so the tsunami, the tsunami, tsunami, excellent reels. Bluefish, 10th place. All right, so the bottom, the last place bluefish, you still get one point. The 10th place bluefish will also get the evict reel from tsunami. We have a pen. Uh, this is a Spin Fisher V SVS 6500. Great reel for the surf and for plugging. All right, sea bass, another 10th place. This is great. So, you know, you have to stay engaged in this contest all year long because you could enter a 10th place sea bass and win a reel. Um, by the way, all of the finalists, all 70 of them, do receive pri a prize as well. We have a pack, uh, a pack of uh, owner hooks along with uh, a lure from Tsunami. Okay, so the next item is a great prize. It's a Daiwa Saltis 8000 spinning reel. Alrighty, and the position is, wow, it's a sea robin, the eighth place sea robin. Okay, that would be the position for this Daiwa Salt Saltis 8000. We have a Fenwick Nighthawk it's a complete fly fishing outfit. It's an eight weight fly fishing outfit, rod, reel, uh, backing, fly line, really everything you need to get started uh, or uh, continue, uh, add to your arsenal of fishing rods. Uh, a great fly fishing outfit from Fenwick. And that's going to be the number two bluefish position, okay? That'd be a lot of fun on that fly rod. And uh, we have 10 of these. This is from Yuzuri. Uh, it is a, <clears throat> it's a, they're, they're a super fluorocarbon leader along with their hydro, uh, hydro minnow uh, in the chicken scratch color, very effective and proven color. So we're going to pick 10 of these uh, and they're going to be randomly, based on what I pick here, randomly positioned on our standings board. So the first one is Porgy, third place Porgy. And number two, Seabass, eighth, uh, eighth position. Bluefish, number three, the third position. Porgy, second position. Uh, this is uh, Bluefish, number four. Fluke, number ten. Bluefish, number five. And Bluefish, number two. I think we got one more. And what do we got there? Uh, porgy number one. First place position for Porgy. Okay, so that is our, we're, gonna, we're going to post the standings, uh, the grid, and plug in all these prizes that we've actually selected here today. Uh, so you can see uh, you know, which, which, prize, uh, which positions are associated with which prizes. Remember, this is a subscriber-only competition, and um, you know you'll need to 
uh, be a subscriber um, before you enter a fish. It starts May 1st, so I would suggest going to the website or calling us here uh, to get your subscription going. Uh, it's season long, there's multi-species, get acquainted with the rules, and um, you know this could be the year where you walk away with not only one of the uh, really well-built northeast fishing boats, um, fully equipped, but really with the ultimate bragging rights in terms of your fishing capabilities. And anybody who winds up on our standings board, you know, really has achieved much because uh, it is very competitive when you consider the fact that anglers throughout the entire region are engaged in this contest. So, you know, I wish you good luck out there, good fishing, and uh, thanks for tuning in today. Again, Mike Caruso with The Fisherman Magazine.